Hey, Carlos! Hey! Hey, Carlos, do you like the bike theme? Hey! Hey, Carlos! What are you doing just standing there? Come on, bike with me! Carlos, 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 car, 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 this is why I should make videos at 2am. So I got a sort of good news, bad news about this gym fight, and before we go in, I'm going to put, uh, Krauss, he's not Krauss, he's Buddy. I'm gonna put Buddy out front so he's sort of a scouter. I would put Zora, but he might actually have some good use, and I know I'm butchering that pronunciation. So, good news, bad news. Good, bad news, I already did this fight. Good news, I probably would have kicked his ass, but I just need to use a lot of healing items. So it wasn't really that interesting a fight. I could have won it, but it was just really tedious and annoying. So I thought, I'm going to give you guys a fight that you can enjoy and watch. But I also do have knowledge from the previous fight, so it'll be more helped. I'll do it like I didn't know what's going on, or at least I'll try. Hump, keep me waiting, didn't you, kid? All right, time to see what you can do. And here we go, our fight with the 5th gym leader, Clay, who looks very serious, and he actually, actually does have crotchless chaps. Why, Nintendo? I think you're, you're getting a little too much there, Nintendo, if you know what I'm saying. If you know what I'm saying, I don't know what I'm saying, honestly. So let's hope Growlithe can take a hit from a Pokemon that's 8 levels ahead of them, and hey, look what Steve's going to be when he grows up. I forget, actually, if Steve... Does Steve evolve after that? I don't know. I don't even know when Steve evolves the first time, so... That does not look good. Yep, <laughs> but he's completely destroyed. So, that's what we have to hope for for Steve that night. And, uh, we could bring out a roar, but there's the high possibility that we're going to get out sped because I believe Steve is a pretty fast breed of Pokemon. So, we'll go Oswald. Because I assume he doesn't have anything that can super affect us. And then... Hope for the best that we can hopefully knock him out and torment, which actually won't bother us at all because we have one, we have two water type moves that work well and we can just interchange them if we want. So it really doesn't matter if you torment us and there we go. That's a lot better than the first fight where he whiffed on the first move and I was ridiculously, ridiculously, ridiculously pissed at Oswald. And Sand Slash, uh, hmm. Uh, and we're gonna keep Oswald in. We're going off the beaten path. I think Oswald will be able to take out a freaking Sand Slash. Also, another good part of the semi-good news about this fight is that I already... Oh yeah, stupid Torment. I, uh, got a couple levels from that last fight, and Fury Cutter misses! Seriously, my luck is turning completely around for this fight. Why well, didn't have any of this last fight? Impressive. That's some amazing strength you got there. What? You're kidding me! Is this really... Really? Is this what happens when I re-record re a fight? Is this like, okay, Scott, if you're making a video better for your fans, uh, I'm fine with this. Clay, Clay, good guy Clay, he's like, okay, yeah, you're gonna take a couple dives when he's recording. The last match, we knew he was gonna throw it out, so let's get already to the exit drill. And got Oswald go 3 for 3 and make this sort of, uh, okay, I can't do that. Uh, oh yeah, and also Oswald learn revenge. Revenge is a move that does 60 damage. Uh, regularly and does 120 damage if you are just hurt by attack. What I'm going to do is go for revenge and because he's steel type we'll get 240 damage if he outspeeds us, which I guarantee he will. Rock slide hopefully don't critical and no! <laughs> so close Oswald! You can't be a Steve! You can't be a Steve Oswald. You can't be a Steve. Uh... I'm going to save. Worst case scenario, we have to come back to Oswald and heal him. We'll go Zora for the uh, Death Botter, who's just going to come out here and get destroyed by whatever Exodra throws at him. And I'm not going to freak out. In the first recording, I brought him out, and I thought I, like, glitched out something. I didn't realize he changed his form. Also, that he's a shiny, apparently. That's kind of cool. I can't tell. I'm terrible with telling what Pokemon are regular and what are shinies. Uh, hmm. What do we want to do? Steve or Aurora? We'll go Aurora, because Aurora has the best type, best chance of actually doing some legitimate damage. Even though I don't think he'll be able to outspeed. Oh, he can outspeed with Quick Attack, he won't do anything, but we'll go Force Palm. Hopefully he can take... Oh, uh, I don't believe in him that much. Yeah. Oh, wow, I'm back to square B of getting my ass kicked. I really thought this fight would go better. And apparently not, so let's... Uh, we'll go Dig? 
Can Steve do the slash? Hopefully Steve can take a slash. Steve! Oh, God. Am I really gonna lose this fight again? Because <sighs> Rock Slide... Oh, that, that flinch screwed me up so bad. Uh, Hyper Potion. Do something stupid! And it sucks, all the things he could do stupid are like boost his attack. Maybe Slash won't be enough to half us? <sighs> slash is enough to... What am I supposed to do? I can't win this fight! Uh, Hyper Potion again? Just I gotta hope for something stupid, and he's gonna just keep on kicking your ass. Is there anything we can... Can he whiff? Is Slash 100% hit? Okay, there's a 47 damage. I, I, we're just waiting for a critical now to kill us. This, I thought this fight was going to go better with Oswald at such a higher level. But it looks like we're going to get our ass kicked again because there's no stupid things that he can do. Hopefully this will do. Uh, it's just a little short of half. Why can't Oswald just be a tiny bit more of a tank? We're just going to waste up all of our hyper potions. He's going to end up getting a critical. Can, can I just see what your other moves are? I want to see this entire boutique. Just do little less damage? Oh, I know that's not how it works, but seriously, is this really how I'm going to lose this fight? Just by not just being a tiny, tiny bit too short? Because I know I can't outspeed you. There's nothing I can do for this. Let me, okay, let me think logically what I can do with revive switching. Uh... I would have to revive switch to that guy. I wish I had a full revive. That that's how I could win this fight. Someone who can take a hit, but everyone's weak. There's no way I can get this set up. There, I'm just stuck in a hope for the best sort of situation. This really is awful, and I have to use a hyper potion because I don't know why I wasn't using them before. Can something happen where I can win this fight, or is it just like a dead end? I think this might be a dead end. And I know I can't outspeed him. Yeah, just go for the razor shell. There's nothing I can do. This is so stupid. I'm legitimately like two HP away from defeating him. Oh my god. That one flinch killed me. So we're putting Oswald out front because we know it's coming. But sorry, boys and girls. This fight, I don't have luck with gym fights usually. I mean, last fight was probably... That was one of the most epic gym battles I ever had. I guess I just don't have luck with gym fights and making good videos out of them. I mean, this is almost 50 minutes coming on just recording this episode. Because I had the fail gym recording, I had the second one that just went awful. So, this is how this gym is just going to end up. It just doesn't work well. And, uh, okay, I just go water pulse then with the intimidate. It just... I don't have luck in gyms. I I don't know why, but now it's just going to be an Oswald destroying fest. Unless something crazy goes wrong again, and I fail again, which I would get really, really, really super pissed. That it's like it's a whole new level of saves on title getting irritated. See, I I don't get pissed off. I get irritated. That is actually the correct thing. So what we want to go is we want to go into Steve. We are going to see. We're going to heal up. Oswald first turn, then Steve is going to dig to end the rollout that he will most likely be putting up unless he's very stupid. It's just that one freaking, and I don't know why he spent so much time using hyper potions that I most likely cut out. I just wasted a ton of hyper potions. And now he's going to crush Claw like a actually smart guy because that will most likely kill Steve. Nope, Steve's a beast and he holds on. And at least we don't have to listen to the terrible doo-doo, uh, doo-doo music. So let's just bite and not even get the chance to attack. Bring Oswald back in, get a level up, destroy, go back into Exadrill, and just see how the fight should go and be very disappointed because unless something crazy happens, this is it. Michael Jackson's wonderful show. And I don't know how I got to... Oh, yeah, this is it. That was the name of his movie. I don't know why I wanted to call it a TV show. Impressive, that's some strength you got. Hopefully some crazy random happenstance doesn't happen where we get our ass kicked again. Thank you, I appreciate that. Please don't drop anything important. Okay, it's only, it's only defense. We don't need defenses where we're going. 
so we water pulse him. We're gonna switch out to Zorark, heal our Oswald back up. See, it's just at this point, it's it's disappointingly stupid because we're just like, eh. And I really hope Oswald doesn't evolve sometime soon. It's probably it's usually like 32 is the lowest, so it's just like Azor might have more damage, but he can. But he's not going to be any help in this gym, even with some crazy thing. I think Zoro actually outspeeded Exedril because he's crazy speed or something, but, but he can't do anything. Hopefully he doesn't do some sort of boosting move, he's just most likely going to bulldoze. So let's go Hyper Potion. I wish this theme could be epic, just very disappointing. So let's just heal some more, get slid it, and... Now there's, if there's something crazy again where we get critted or we flinch again, you, you don't understand my level of freaking pissed off. Because this is, it's pulling up on 50 minutes, so let's go revenge, 240 damage, if we can actually get- WHY DIDN'T YOU METAL CLAW EARLIER?! WHY IS THIS THE FIRST TIME I'M SEEING THIS GODDAMN MOVE?! YOU COULD'VE DONE IT WHEN I WAS HEALING ALL THIS TIME AND STOP WASTING MY TIME, YOU METAL CLAW NOW?! REALLY?! YOU ARE AN ASS! Oh. Not just a regular ad, you are- Oh, that irritates me so freaking much that you would do something like that. Let's water post, hope for the confusion. That is so goddamn dumb that you did not metal claw any of those times. You did, it did cross your mind in the AI and be like, eh, hey, yeah, let's metal claw. No, nah, you just want to piss me off, so I gotta wait all this time just to do one freaking move that I- Ah, that is actual irritation coming from me that that was the only time that decided to show up. Go to hell, Clay! Man, man, if you so cool if you see it, you 32 minutes, go to hell, Clay. Phew, you've really something. Yeah, I'm happy Ruben Stutter beat you, stupid Clay again. Little whippersnapper trainers who keep a real punch, keep showing up one after another. Hmm, take this. And after all that fun time, we get the mineral badge. Christ, Marie, it's not rocks, they're minerals. <sighs> Mineral badge? Quake badge, okay. So this is your fifth badge, huh? Is that so? Pokemon up the level 60 will obey you. Here, take this too. Yay, another ground move. Actually, that's probably good for Steve. Let me check that out. He'll probably tell us about it. Oh, oh I, I don't know. Well, I suppose, come this away. Are we going to take some cool elevator out of here so we don't have to walk the whole entire thing again? Uh, what are we doing, Clay? Good dances. Dancers are crucial for putting on a good show. Uh, what does that have to do with anything? Okay. Uh, let's just check out Boldos real quick before we end off this episode. I I actually tried to scroll down with my mouse mouse wheel to scroll down this. Sixty. The user stops on the ground and attacks everything there. The target's target speed is reduced. That does 60. How much does Dig do? I Did I go buy Dig or something? There's Dig. Ah, nope. Not Volt Switch. Dig does 80, but it takes two turns, so it's kind of tedious. So, uh, I guess I'll probably teach both the people. I'll do that next episode. But next time on Let's Play Pokemon White 2, you can just hear the irritation in my voice. We'll actually get some stuff done. Yeah, oh, no, with well, gyms is sort of important. You really can't skip around it. Next time on Let's Play White 2 Blind, we will head out of Drivel City and possibly see, I'm assuming there's some sort of cutscene with Clay and Carlos right outside the gym and something about plasma. Something about plasma! So, yeah, that's something. If you enjoyed my disappointment and you were also disappointed, leave a like down below. If you were also disappointed, leave a dislike down below. I've been safe untitled. See you guys next time. Clay's an asshole. Ruben Sutter for life.